Now, on the note of stuff I didn't find, um, I was thinking about it, and by the time this episode even goes live, I'll have already been, you know, starting the walkthrough and whatnot, and people will have been discovered stuff, so as such, stuff that I do find, I'm just going to edit onto the end of this episode, so the final episode is a lot of wrap-up stuff, and already, there's something we found. Uh, so you may remember, after we beat Estelle Naturalborn, that right over here, there was a thing, and it was like, cannot proceed without a Ring of Oath. Well, I forgot about it, uh, up until a little bit talking to a buddy. This is the ring, the Dark Moon Ring, Ring of Lunar Princess Ronnie's Cold Oath. So, just coming down here, this is now open, and if we look at the map, this is what's going to take me on up. This will finally get me to the area that I've been trying to get to. And hopefully, hopefully this area will uh, allow me to get to that weird Parthenon type place. I mean, looking at the map, so this one isn't connected to that, but I don't know. We had, we took a bunch of coffins over here, and so I'm starting to think there's a coffin I missed that's going to get me over to where that thing is, but if we find that, I will, um, I mean, if there's enough, Moonlight Altar, oh, I think I know what we're getting here. There, something sounds angry and hungry. Wait, is this the dragon that dipped out on me? That's a different dragon. I have not seen that dragon. Uh, let me go find like a grace. I need a, I need either a grace or a steak or something. Big old pissed off dragon. I mean, I ain't scared of no dragons, but. You never know, man. You never know. You think you're you're safe, and then the next thing you know, a dragon one shots you. Moonfolk ruins. I mean, just based on all the moon, I would be very surprised if we... Oh, oh no, god, right, no. Ah! Ah, what the fuck? I mean, this place is ridiculous. What is happening? Too tired for this? Oh. At least the enemies aren't a threat. Who will stop this? How much y'all want to bet? A million dollars says I find Moonlight Greatsword somewhere here. I mean, what did this place call it? It was like the moon. It was like moon ruins and moon hill and... I mean, no way there's not a Moonlight Sword. Every FromSoft game has had the Moonlight Sword. Magic, please. I need to find a grace so I can make it daytime. Okay, let me... Oh, I didn't mean to torrent. I meant to hit this. There we go. I can see a little bit. Um, nope. These magic swords are getting on my nerves. Hang on, let me... I wonder if it's like that one. No, oh, hang on. See, this one looks very central. But we were just running in there and I didn't see anything. And then that looks kind of centrally too. find these stupid guys so that I can pull up my map. It's 
stop it. I'm trying to do stuff. Who? Where are you? Stop teleporting! Maybe they're related to the puzzle. Maybe I gotta kill all these dudes. down. Alright, no more. No more of that. Um... Hmm. Not found a ruin that doesn't have a thing that goes underground. It's gotta be here. Where? Is it like an illusion? Be that I have to smack the ground somewhere? Hmm. There's, there's this. Looks like there's other stuff here too. Let me go over here. There should be a grace. And if I can find a grace, I can make it daytime. Slim Dragon Abdullah. Are you the one I was killing before when everything went down? Hatred of Manasemus. Starlight Shards. Starlight Shards. Starlight Shards. Jesus. Starlight Shards. More Starlight Shards. Wow. I think these are, um... These are for trading to Celibus for items, but since he's dead, I can trade to the Bell Lady and get his spells, I guess. There's another one over there, probably. Alright, we need to make it morning time so I can actually see. Manus Celis. boss or something? What the fuck? Oh, dude, what is this? Wear ring. Ooh. It's like Ronnie, but not her. And this is a, a three finger? Like the madness one? getting a waifu. Like a doll stitched together. It is there I shall find mine order. I bid thee, travel the path of the Lord. And once all is done, we shall see each other once more. Just like the hand. 
Dark Moon Greatsword. There it is. All right. DDC 161138. It causes frost buildup. Moonlight Greatsword raises it aloft, bathing in light of the Dark Moon. Increases magic attack power and imbues with frost. Charge attacks, release blasts of moonlight. Well, we know what we're going for on our uh, on our end build now. The fact that there's fingers down here, um, this this has got it. This is the third ending, I think. Because I remember the the trophies. There's like the madness. There's the Lord, and then there's something with stars. And the more I'm thinking about it, so there's the whole. Uh, this is where I drop down. There's the whole like you know we we, we got to fight some crazy star beast before we can come here. So that's very cosmosy. And she just talked about like I'll return to the you know the night sky or whatever. Where do we pop out? We just pop out right down here. Yeah, I I would be very very surprised if this isn't somehow related to the third ending. So I think for the walkthrough prep we're gonna. We're going to do her whole quest line. And uh yeah, we'll do her quest line and we'll see if that triggers the ending somehow. Because even then she was like, you know, walk the path to Lord and then I'll see you at the end. Lunar estate ruins. There's so many ruins, and I can't find the thing in any of these ruins. Oh no, you don't. We're not nope, stop. Stop right now. Uncomfortably close. I mean, these ruins aren't very. Oh, hang on. I'm supposed to go. The, the main ruins are over there. It's gonna turn into a episode completely on its own. As long as this is going. I don't even know what it was blocking. I think I just part of the wall just broke down. did you unlock? I'm so confused, dude. We hit. Oh, here we go. What the hell, I swear to God that was not there like half a second ago. Ah, well that's a waste. All that, and I just get a Cerulean medallion.
We got two dragons to kill. There's that one dragon we saw, there's that other dragon, and then there's the two ruins. So let's just murder everything. And then, um, this might be its- I might just make this its own episode. Uh, something over here. This is where we popped out. So then down there is where we saw the dragon. Ooh, that's a big, deep, deep ball. There's another tower over there. Yeah, this is gonna have to be its own episode. There's just too, just too much here. Where's that first dragon I saw? Place where, we yeah, that's the cathedral. We got the cathedral. Lunar estate ruins was Cerulean Medallion. I wouldn't be surprised if there's like multiple puzzle towers here. Just because, you know, spell stuff. But one of these towers might be what has a sending gate. That sending gate may send me the Parthenon area that I've been trying to reach for a long time. So yeah, I actually just, I just wrapped up the review. Got the review done. I was sitting there, uh, talking with, with someone else who was doing the review. We were, uh, I mentioned, I was like, yeah, I finished the Ronnie quest line. But, you know, I never, or I said, I was like, I never, never figured out where, how to get to that area that was north in, uh, the Urnia, and I never figured out how to get to that weird Parthenon place. He was like, Oh, did you, did you finish the Ronnie quest line though, right? And I'm like, yeah, yeah, you know, I got the, the doll went quiet. I got the armor, uh, all that stuff. And he's like, well, but up, up there is from the Ronnie quest line. And I was like, ah, oh, I didn't, I didn't know. We were very nice beasts, not worried about that. I need more spell slots. I'll come here at a later time. I'm not doing that right now. I have more of those towers I haven't even solved. Um, but I was like, what, what do you mean finish the quest line? Like, I finished the quest line, and he's like, oh no, there's a, you gotta take the coffin, and the coffin is gonna lead you to a secret boss, and I'm like, yeah, you know, they got the, the marbles. It's like, I killed, I killed Marble Man. He's like, you didn't, you, there's stuff past Marble Man, and I'm like, what are you talking about? So I pull up my episode where we, where we fought the, uh, ah, shit. I pulled up the episode where we fought that guy. And sure enough, I got hit with that, you know, that like, uh, blah, 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 you cannot pass the seal. And I was like, oh my god, I have the seal. So yeah, that was a, that was a pretty big, pretty big realization. Alright, dragon, where are you at? You want to materialize so I can murder you? on my bar.
big dumb dragon. Gula's Moonblade. Uh, sorcery? Cool. Finding lots of cool stuff here for when I play the mage. Alright, and then these ruins, I can actually kind of see now. something oh you see anything mimic man Other dragon it's down there, right? Man, these runes are throwing me for a loop because I'm not seeing the pathway. Let me let me go. Like, here's what we're gonna do. This is already gonna have to be its own episode. It's too long. And just slap this on top of the end. That was, that was the plan when I started recording this. Um, figured I would just add this uh, onto the end of what was the final Let's Play episode, because I spent like... That episode involved me just like running around for like 20 minutes at the end, trying to find stuff like this and just failing, so that doesn't make any sense. Might as well keep it a little more focused. Stop it. Stop it. Man, the last ruin all it had was a cerulean medallion, and I'm about to say, screw this place. There's nothing here. What if it's like you have to come to the ruins at night and the moonlight unveils your path or some bullshit? Go, uh, go spank this dragon instead and get over to that other tower. Oh man, you're not even named. Where are you running?
Oh, you messed up. Oh, it got me. You little shit. Dragon spent more time running than it did fighting. Oh god, that would have would have been like five, six hundred thousand runes just poofed. I don't think I get anything for killing this guy. I think it's just runes, but maybe I'll get a dragon heart or something. Who knows? My turn. We're not doing the runaway game again. over too soon. That's what you get. Should have known I am the boss. I've killed death itself. Stand no chance. Oh, there's just a bunch of them out here. Oh, man. Well, I could definitely farm up dragon hearts, that's for sure. Looks like I get nothing special for them, though. And is this another memory tower? Let's find out. What is that for? Where does that take me? Oh, it's an Everjail! I love a good Everjail. Keep running. I'm just gonna keep beating you with this.
Goodbye, Electo. Black Knife Tish. I'm guessing that's a legendary summon. Which I need those to work on the platinum, so that's good. Another one located. Uh, so we had a Everjail. We had a Memory Tower. Altar South. It's like an Altar North. We had the entrance. We had the ruins. That and that. The only thing I didn't get, I didn't figure out what the deal is with Moonfolk ruins, but I, I don't know, man. We we ran around and ran around and ran around. And I didn't see anything, and I'm guessing it has to do with the casting build. So either way, let's wrap this one up. Um, since this went so long, I don't I don't know. Maybe I'll just keep the. The previous episode exactly how it was but yeah that was cool so if i end up finding more i'll record it see y'all later